Hi Brad from WordPressSites.net uh, The latest uh, WordPress default theme 2011 has just been released uh, over the last few days. It's still in beta. It's available for WordPress.com uh, free hosted uh, accounts and it's also available in beta for, uh, for WordPressDog.org self hosted accounts and I've installed it on one of my one of my blogs, theme for WordPress.com. So here it is. Here it looks pretty nice. It's pretty impressive compared to uh, what they've previously been using, 2010, which uh, never really interested me, but uh, it never really impressed me. But uh, this this one's a lot nicer. It's got a lot of really good features. Um, you can switch between black and white. It's got about seven different post formats you can use. So well, let's just have a look at the back end. Just before we have a look at the back end, it is available for download. I have got a link on my site. I've uploaded it to my server, and I've written a full blog post on it here. Um, and here's the, here's the link here. It's already been downloaded a, a few times already. So uh, if you want to give it a go, you can download it from here. I've actually installed the, uh, the, the next version of WordPress, uh, WordPress 3.2. Not on this site here, but on, on my other site where I've installed uh, 2011 as well, so it's working perfectly. And uh, I'll just show you the back end and all the different options. Here's the theme options here, some of them anyway. I'm using the black and white with the black background. We've also got a white background as well, um, so that's pretty good. Uh, the layout, you've got three different options there. You've got content on the left, content on the right, or no sidebar at all, so, uh, so that's pretty good and uh, there's a few other options I'll show you as well. So here we are in the back end. You've got seven different formats to choose from which is really good. There's got a gallery format, um, image format. There's quite a few really good formats there. So you can change the, uh, the format of the post uh, and also you've got three templates to choose from as well. There's also a footer area with three footer widgets which, which hasn't been uh, included before in the WordPress default theme so this saves you adding any code or making any, any footer widgets if that's what you need. The other templates are photo log and tumble log so uh, I think that'll be fairly popular. Um, I've mentioned the seven post uh, formats, the widgets. We've got rotating headers, so you can put in multiple uh, header images and they'll automatically rotate. Uh, there's pull quotes, so you can have the quotes on the left or the right. You can align them very easily. You can change the colour of the links very easily. And the, the colour schemes and the layouts, as I said before, uh, they're very easy to change. And you'll find with the, the images which are included, in the file, they also include the PSD file, so it makes it very easy to, to customize this uh, theme into your, your own unique theme. So there you have it, that's the latest WordPress default theme, 2011, and there's a link on my site if you want to download that and, and have a play around with it. Just don't uh, don't forget it is, it is in beta. I haven't found any problems with it at all. It's been really smooth and I've also installed uh, WordPress 2.3 and 3.2 as well. So uh, which, that's got a quite some qu uh, good features as well. So you might consider having a go at that on a test site. Cheers.